Hello guys, welcome at my Climby Fisher slash Simon Climby collection. As you can see, I spread it all out on my bed. I can do a little over tour and I will go in depth in a minute. As you can see, it's quite a lot. Which I'm very happy about, of course. So let's just r dive right in. So I am going to start with the Climbing Fisher LPs. I only have two, unfortunately, but I've got this one, which is signed. And I'm not Helene. I bought it from, I guess, from her. Um, but this is the autograph from Simon Climby, which is amazingly cool. And this is the autograph from Rob Fisher, so it's very special. And this is the uh, album Everything. This is the back. So there you go. And then, of course, I've got the normal album without any autographs. Also, the back. So then I'm going to the maxi singles, which I have quite a lot from. I've got this one. It's not supposed, it's been a bit hard to show you the whole thing. So bear with me for a second sometimes if I try to get it in screen all. So it's not supposed to be the way. Um, the, uh, that way, this is the Nomad Soul remix. I do want to collect everything from Climby Fisher if it's possible. So this is also, it's not supposed to be that way, but this is the Music Factory Mega Mix. I also collect if it's a different sleeve or it's uh, printed in a different country, I will also collect that. So everything. <laughs> so those two. Then I have another, it's not supposed to be that way, but this is a promo, it's not for sale, so this is a promo, it's very cool, this is a promo from the Nomad Soul Remix, and this is, it's not supposed to be that way, a 12 inch version, also a promo, so that's really cool. Then I have another promo, but that is for This Is Me. This is the This Is Me mix. Very cool. The back is not... Uh, was a bit fair. And this is the dubs, dub one claps and dub one vocals on this side. So very cool. And then I have this one. This Is Me. And I'm not sure from what country it is, so... But this has a different sleeve. Because this is also This Is Me, but this is the This Is Me mix. Also a different sleeve, very cool, I think. Let's show the back as well. There you go. Then I have an, a very special one and very hard to find. Well, pretty hard to find. Uh, I will f first show it in the sleeve, but this is the I Won't Bleed For You, and this one is etched. So I will take it out so you can... I hope I, it will turn up on the screen. I need to be very careful, so bear with me. Oh, you can see me. Hello. <laughs> um, oh, if I hold it this way, you can see it a bit. It's etched. That's so cool. So, and very special, like I said. Um, so, we'll put that in the sleeve again. Then, this is the normal I won't, I won't bleed for you. And this is the back. So, eventually, I really want to have everything of them. This love changes everything, the, the most famous one, with a sticker, this is the 12 house mix, includes the 12 house mix. But I've got that. Then I can do this, I hope. 
Then this is another one without the sticker. But this is from a different country. I believe the one was from Holland and the other one is from the UK printed. No, this is not working. Sorry guys. <laughs> so Rise to the Occasion, the Hip Hop Remix. This was in Holland, I believe. Then I've got this. This is also a different kind of sleeve. Not not like the picture is different, but it's a different material. That's the back. This one is a bit scratched in the corner, which is a pity. But this is the, just the rise to the occasion. This is not a hip hop remix. I hope it's visible. There you go. <laughs> and uh, yep, a fourth one. <laughs> Ta-da! It's a bit scratched here, which is a pity. So that's uh, all different kind of ones from uh, to, from the UK. I do have from Holland, uh, made in the EEC. Not not sure what country that is or something. I do have this one, Facts of Love. And now this is a bit going to be a bit hard because this is a poster sleeve. So I hope I can show you the poster. So let's see. It will be big. <laughs> a jump cut to that. Okay, I laid it down. I still I'm still holding a bit because otherwise you have a big glare but this is the whole poster on one side I turn it over because it has two sides okay it's a bit visible that's the other side and as you can see it was already like that when I bought it unfortunately I have this one love like a river this is the back And this is another edition again. As you can see, the sleeve is different, colors and photos a bit different on the places. So I do have a, a, a one of them was the Mega Mix that I showed you before. the The one before this one was the Mega Mix. Mix. Oops, wrong one. I've got this one. Also a bit different. And this was... Uh, one is from the UK. And the other one is, I think, is from Holland as well. Or the UK, but just a different sleeve is also possible. And I've got this fire on the ocean. Lovely song. All lovely songs, of course. <laughs> Like this one. This is in France, I believe, even. Not sure. The EEC, I guess. Maybe that's... I'm not sure if that's France. Let me know if, if you know what EEC is. And this one from Fire on the Ocean. This is the 12th special mix is on here it says so that's the difference and also the country is UK so now I'm going to the singles Climber Fisher singles where which are here which is a bit easier <laughs> to hold love changes everything just the normal I'm not gonna tell every country or anything because then the video will be amazingly long. I do have this picture disc from Love Changes Everything, which is really cool. I have Love Like a River, and this is a poster sleeve as well, so I will show you. 
So it's a bit hard to show, but this is the poster sleeve. Rob is a bit tired, it looks like. <laughs> and the the back is just not really a poster, it's just uh, the outer sleeve, which you can see. Keeping the mystery alive, single. This is me. Another this is me. As you can see, back is different as well. And a different country again. Facts of love. And of course you can't read all uh, on the back and that's not my intention because that will be very long as well. I won't bleed for you and this is a... not in the original sleeve. But I found it. I think or I bought it. It's not supposed to be that way. The Nomad Soul Mix. Of course I bought it, or maybe I got it. Sometimes I get, uh, get gifts as well, of course. Rise to the occasion, the hip hop mix. I said it very weirdly, I believe. <laughs> Rise to the occasion. <laughs> the uh, Another hip hop mix, uh, this one is from a different country again. The third one, <laughs> hip hop mix. And the fourth one, also the hip hop mix. I don't have the normal one, I guess, or was that the first one? No, this is all hip hop mix. Still need to find the other one. Let's see. So this was UK, EEC, Europe, just uh, different countries and stuff. This is me. Oh, this is another this is me. But this one is really cool. Look open it up. A very cool photo. Another very cool photo. And then these two are a little little booklets. So can open it for you. So a, a lovely photo and there's some information like favorite album, lucky number, star sign, favorite color, clothes, favorite food, etc. Um, about Simon Climbing is this one. Well <laughs> Two gorgeous photos again. And on, on the right side is C Rob Fisher. Also a little booklet. If I can open it up. A lovely photo again. Also the same questions. And he won't cooperate wait, with me. <laughs> there are some other cool photos. And then here is the single. <laughs> So that's very cool, I think. I'm glad I have this one. And then I've got two of these. This is the special offer pack. Fire on the Ocean special pack contains limited edition prints. I've got two of them, one just normal and one with sticker. So yeah, I collect that as well. So I will show you quickly what's inside. Can you still, yeah, you can see it here. It's a bit me opening. <laughs> So this is of obviously the, the single itself. And then you've got these prints with it. The limited edition prints. And actually you can actually kind of frame them. Maybe I will, uh, because I have two, maybe I will do that later on. Not now, but um, in the far future. Maybe I will do that. That would be nice to frame this. So, that is what you get with that. And then I've got one very special one. <laughs> and I don't know if you can see this, but this is clear blue. This is Love Changes Everything. Promotional copy. It's a promo. It's also, as you can see, I will get it out, blue. 
need to be very careful here. There you go, it's blue. And it, like I said, it's promotional copy and it is also a flexi disc. As you can see, it's very unstable, <laughs> it's very flexible. So this is one of my proudest uh, in the collection. Of course, I have more where I'm very happy that I have that, but this is one of my most special items. Then we continue on with the cassettes. I have uh, this one, which is also a rare one, I believe. Climbing Fisher, Fire on the, Fire on the Ocean. There you go. So I'm glad I have this one as well. Then I have a Coming In for the Kill. This is just a regular one, but also very nice. And then I have this one, I'm also very very special for me and very glad I have this. Climbing Fisher Everything, that is just the album and as you can see there are two connected to each other. The other one is called Introducing Climbing Fisher and that's a uh, musical introduction. So it's a little interview and that's really nice. Um, I was so glad that I found this. <laughs> So that's very special as well. It's a double box, as you can see. I love it. I love, love, love it. So then we're going to the CDs. Of course, the most famous album, Climbing Fisher, Everything. Ta-da, the back. Then I have this, the best of Climbing Fisher. Which has all the hits, of course. Coming in for the kill. The normal version. And then I have this one, the coming in for the kill plus bonus tracks. Also very glad I found this one because the bonus tracks are oh so good. And this one is, uh, like you see, you can see there, it has bonus tracks. It's not the normal. One. And this one is also a bit hard to find. And this one, Climbing Fisher, keep it special. Oh, I need to... I first got this one. This one is uh, printed by another fan of Climbing Fisher who printed it for me because I didn't have it yet. So this was the printed version. I had one. I'm very happy. I still have it. And this one, I finally found the real one later on. So, and this one is from Japan, which is very special and mostly rare. There you go. Japan. <laughs> so this is the real one. And I also have two other copies from that person. The 12th um, old B-Sides collection with extended versions and s remixes and stuff and the 12th collection with all remixes and mixes so very cool and these are printed as well of course I do have one other CD which is this one and this one is a very tiny one is a 3 inch maxi CD Facts of Love, and I love this one. It's so tiny, it's so cute. Look at this. Isn't that very cute? Compared to my hand. Compared to a real CD. He has. Oh, that's... Uh, there you go. It's, it's very cute, right? <laughs> and, and then I've got this a single. CD single. The rise to the occasion. And this is one is not printed, but a real one. Um, then I have the CD uh, singles, like that one is one as well, but that's a paper sleeve, and this ones are just regular plastic sleeves. I've got this one. I won't bleed for you. Nothing on the back. <laughs> I have Facts of Love, also not really much on the back. <laughs> this is me, Fire on the Ocean, 
And it's not supposed to be that way. There you go. You go on that. <clears throat> I am moving you a bit to the sides. That's because it's w a bit easier. So now I'm going to this one. <clears throat> Firstly, this is a star album from Bravo. A Climbing Fisher special edition. I have two of these. <laughs> you will see the other one in this thing. Because this is my... <clears throat> um, not sure how you call it in English. Map. Organizer. That's it. This is my organizer. And I keep all the Climbing Fisher articles or paper things I have in here. Because it's safe. <laughs> so these are the interviews and articles. I will go through it, but I will not stop at anything, so on everything, so I, I will just slip it by a little fast, so you can see what I have. So this is all articles from uh, out of magazines, I hope you can see it a bit, it's a bit hard to... Um, get the pages to flip. That's as well. And this one. Then I've got there a little one. <laughs> and these are little ones as well. This one and the one on the back. Also, I, I do have a few doubles in here. Like these ones. <laughs> but I don't care about that. Hold on, just to win. Okay, there. Oops, so sorry. I stumped you. So these are small articles, as you can see. These ones. And in this one, I also, on the end, have very special things. So keep watching. <laughs> There's the other star album, album as you can see. This one I need to get out because this is a whole magazine. Kept that in. So I need to search for one. Let's see where it is. I found this. There you go, there it is. <laughs> At home with them. So that's very cool. That's the article and I just thought, well, I can keep it in here, why not? Then I here got a loose pack. Well, I get it, got it out because it's not in separate sleeves yet. So there it is. And there, as you can see, Simon Climby. There. Oh. <laughs> That one, that one. I also keep the posters in here and the, um, this is where it is, there, <laughs> very small. Um, how you call that, the advertations? Ta -da. The, um, the adverts for new coming out stuff. Go. Oh, this is, you can win. You can win an autograph with Clammy. I <laughs> I wasn't alive back then, but otherwise, <laughs> it's a, a pity I can never see a show of them again because Rob Fisher already passed away. He passed away very way too early, way too young. And Climby Fisher is uh, Simon Climby is still uh, busy with making songs and the documentary and stuff, especially with Eric Clapton. 
But he's not singing anymore. Long time ago he sang. So yeah, it's just late 80s, begin 90s, and I was born in 1990, so that was a bit too late. Then we go to the posters, and um, I will get these out, I think, or... No, I can see these ones, so you can see it, I hope. <laughs> There. No, come on. I need to take that one out. Ta da! I always think magazine posters are great, but the line in there because of the 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 staples and stuff that's also always horrible. I think. That one. That one. So yeah, this takes a bit of time, that's the problem. I can't take it out all. This one. It's a very big one. Love it. But Climby Fisher is very hard to find stuff on, or information. And of course you have the regular things. But yeah, like I said, that's, that's very hard to... Uh, to find information on, especially on these days. This one, taxi. <laughs> um, and mostly it's, it's always the same um, release, like the Everything album, which I already have. Hey, Neil Diamond. <laughs> I'm also a fan of Neil Diamond. One day that collection will be online here as well. Not for now. Oh, oh wow. I do have this is weird. I do have this this in here whilst it's in new diamond and not climbing, okay. And I'm back now here are the commercials under it, so like let's see, there you go. Guess that's what that's a double one. These ones are a bit smaller, as you can see, also double. <laughs> These are on the side. Oh, and oh, yeah, I forgot about that. I also have lyrics, song lyrics from magazines. There you go. All ordered. <laughs> Love changes everything. That was a doll as well. And now we go to the other ones. And this one, these ones are special. So I will get these out and be back. So. So I kept it in the sleeves because that's a bit easier. I have this uh, unused Climbing Fisher ticket from 1989. And together with this sticker where you can join them after the show. Oh man, I would love to go there if I have a time machine. <laughs> I would love to go there. This one is very special. This is a self-portrait by Simon Climby, drawn and signed by him. So he obviously can sing better than he can draw. <laughs> Sorry if you're watching this Simon Climbing, but keep stick to the singing <laughs> or composing or anything. But it's really cool. I'm so glad I have this. And this one is by Rob Fisher. 
but you obviously could see that it was him, right? <laughs> and of course, signed by Rob Fisher and two kisses. Oh, that's very cool. So I'm very, very happy and glad I have this. I have no clue why they actually signed uh, a drawn this drawn. Why they actually drawn themselves and signed it? For what occasion? Was it for a show? I'm not sure. If you have information about that, I would love to know. Then I've got a few promo photos. I've got this one. And the whole text on the back. Uh, this is actually part of Simon Climbing collection because it's on loan only Simon Climbing, but well it's in here so you can watch it now. As well. Because it's a video for both actually, so Oops. Very pretty photos. Oh, and this has again text on the back. Then I have, oops, this one. And this is a two piece sticker. And this is a, a very small playing card. So I, I can turn around as you can see. It's from Merlin Stickers, numbers 86 and 87. And this is from number one or something. So, very cool. And then I have this. And this is also a sticker from Panini. Oh, from the 9089 Smash Hit sticker collection number 32. Very cool. Then in this binder I have a few other articles and such but it's too big to put in the the other one <laughs> it's not a4 mostly commercial stuff as you can see there you go then i have two climby fisher pins I have a copy of the video tape on DVD Oops. because I firstly didn't have the video so but now I have the original video which is very hard to find pretty rare and I made this one myself Mentos had an action not sponsored by the way um, where you could choose your own image to be on your chewing gum so thought why not Climb Fisher, right? So that's all my Climb Fisher stuff, and now I will show you a few bits of Simon Climby stuff because I also collect that. I'm going to the other side for a bit. I have two, no, three, can't count. Um, this is Maxi Single, yeah. I've got this. Does your heart still break? I have this one, not in the original sleeve, because it's a promo only. Soul Inspiration. And I, oops, stay here. I have Oh How The Years Go By. Um, I do have Soul Inspiration on CD from Simon Climbing. And this is just... As you can already know, Simon Climb alone, not with Rob Fisher, so it's not Climb Fisher, it's just himself. I have, whoops, CD single, Soul Inspiration. I have, oh, how the years go by. And does your heart still break? And then the most special thing I have, I own from Simon Climbing is a, this tape. And this is a promo tape with songs turn it on with songs who were, um, who were never came out on CD or anything so besides me and maybe the, the people who made this is no one knows these songs <laughs> so that's very special I'm so glad I have this and I don't know why the songs didn't came out because they are amazing I think so this is the most 
amazing piece in my collection from Simon Climby. So that was my Climby Fisher slash Simon Climby collection. It's all now piled up there, kind of. <laughs> I hope you like this. Uh, more collections are coming as you have... If you have one collection you want to see first, you can always tell me or other videos you want to see. Maybe a Q&A if you want, if you have questions. Can always see that do that if you have stuff of climbing fish or Simon climbing you don't want it anymore you can always send me <laughs> so thank you for watching of course give it a thumbs up subscribe if you haven't already and click the bell to get notifications when i upload again thank you for watching have a good day and goodbye